Hi y'all, this is so so blessed. And my daughter, Derica, right there. We're heading into LA Fitness on this Monday afternoon. And um, as you probably can still hear, I have a cold, bad head cold, but hey, I'm not gonna let that stop me. I got goals and dreams and all that good stuff. All right, and we're gonna tape some of our workouts, so I'll get back with y'all later. Hello everyone, this is um, Certified Star 34 at So So Blessed Daughter. Um, we are starting our workout. These are our new Monday, Wednesday, Friday workout. Today is Monday. We are doing our Monday workout. We did our abs already. Now we are doing shoulders. Um, so So Blessed will perform the upright, upright row for the shoulders. She is keeping her shoulders up. She has a 25 pound plate. She's keeping her shoulders up, elbows are above the shoulder. She's doing 15. We, I actually decreased the workout, and now we are um, doing more reps. So instead of doing 12 or 10 reps, we are now doing 15 reps on everything. She's doing two sets. So arms, yeah, ma. Shoulders should be up, um, elbows should be up a little bit more, like at an angle. So, yeah, so that is the upright row. We'll come back with it. All righty, um, our second shoulders that we do are shrugs. And it's basically, you know, a shrug where you just shrug it off. So she's bringing her, she's relaxed in a way, but in a way she's uh, tensing up her shoulders. I can't really explain it, but the shrugging, she's doing 30. She got the dumbbells in her hand. She's doing 15 of them. And those, and that is the end of our shoulder workout. Alrighty, this, we're on to the arms. These are bench dips. So, so blessed has her legs out and arms. She's in a sitting position and she's just dipping actually. Hence the word bench dips. We do 15 of these. These work your triceps. All in this area should be burning right here. Also works other parts of your body, but the main thing are the triceps. She's doing 15 and we're gonna do two sets of 15. I'll be back with the unmodified version. Okay, y'all know I love y'all, right? Let y'all see all this. But this is my modified version. I had my knees up. She has her knees straight out, her legs straight out. That's the more athletic version. I'll be there in about two, three months. Hope y'all hear me breathing all heavy. But that's tired. Good job, Derrica. Those are bench dips, modified and unmodified. Alrighty, we are doing wrist curls. On, when, on Mondays, we have a random arm machine and that's what Bless chose to do the wrist curls. It's called wrist curls because you're using a wrist to curl. This is the machine down here. Um, it works biceps. So as you can see, those tight biceps busting through. See the cuts, uh-oh. But we do 15 of these and um, two sets of 15. And so, so blessed is struggling, as you can see. And her weight is um, 35. And um, I'll be putting an extra 10 on there for me. But those are our arms. And we'll be back with chest after this. I'm showing y'all Derrick of guns. Of course, she lifts much more weight than I do. But she's 20 years younger, 100 pounds smaller. <laughs> but not for long. Actually, you're not even 100 pounds smaller now, Derrick. You're about 60 pounds smaller than I am. She's gonna let me catch up with her. I ain't letting you catch up with me. <laughs> You're not gonna catch I'm up with me. Alrighty. Alrighty, we're back with the final. Actually, this is chest. Um, we did our push-ups already. We do those directly after abs so that we can already be on the mat. This right here is pullover. This is the stuff that it helps. Hold it. It hold on. It helps this area right here. And 
So, so blessed is doing 15. So it's gonna help her arms, chest, and back area. But I put it under the category of chest. And she's gonna go two sets of 15. Um, these are her weights back here. I put on two 45 pounds and a 25 pound. And it's good to have a helper put this thing down for you. And that's the <laughs> That's the chest workout. I hate her right now. And hate is a strong word that you shouldn't use. Alrighty, on to our legs. Here is the infamous leg extension. It's called leg extension because you're extending your leg, of course. That's what I had to explain to So So Bliss. Because <laughs> she cannot get that through her head. But hopefully this time she gets it. She's doing two sets of 15. We're just gonna take it down slowly, go up. Yep, just like that, that's perfect. And um, her weight is over there at uh, 55 pounds. So um, the more reps you do, the um, more you can leave your weight down. But if you wanna do less reps, then kind of push your weight up a little bit. So you can at least feel the burn. You feel the burn? Yes. Great. Alrighty, this is our last leg of the day. We're doing sit, I call them sit downs, but basically they're just um, we added the ball in just to make things difficult but she's gonna sit down you sit down first and then you throw it to me she's sitting down you can throw it and then she's gonna throw it to me and then I'm gonna throw it back to her okay so that's our sit down class or you can do it without the ball and you just yep just coming up come come back some come down to the end yeah yeah like that, okay. All right, you can stop. All right, and that's our sit down, our last workout of the day. And then we got cardio afterwards. Um, maybe we'll come and show y'all our cardio stuff, so we'll be back. Hi y'all, this is So So Blessed. Welcome to the Blessed Place. How y'all doing? This is hours after that workout that you just saw. Um, it's about 11.30 at night, and I think we did our workout around about 4 o'clock today. But I just wanted to end this video just encouraging you guys who are on a weight loss journey or who have been on a weight loss journey and maybe you fell off the wagon. Uh, maybe you have intentions of getting back on the wagon in the new year. I just want to encourage you that you can do this. You, you might have given up. You might be thinking about giving up. Um, but don't give up. There, You might say to yourself, you know, this is just me. This is the way I am. This is the way I've always been. This is the way I'm going to be. Overweight, over, um, obese, fat, um, whatever it is you want to call it. But if that's not the way you want to be, and I always say, if you are healthy and happy with whatever size you are, then don't let me, the media, society, your man, your family, don't let anyone tell you how you should look, what you should weigh, and how you and what you should lose. But if you are like myself, that you were not comfortable with the weight that you're at and you want to lose weight I'm just encouraging that you can do it there have been so many days that I just said I just I'm just gonna resign my fat myself to the fact that this is just me I'm a big girl I'm overweight I'm fat I'm I'm happy with me I love me and this is just the way I'm gonna be because it is too hard but then there were those days where I not only felt fat, I started to feel obese. And when I started to feel obese, that's when I say, that's when I said to myself, I've got to do something. Deidre, what's the cutoff? I mean, when you got to 200 pounds, you cried and you couldn't believe you were at 200 pounds. When you got to 275, you cried and you couldn't believe you were at 275. When you got to 300, you couldn't believe you were in the 300s. God, when you got the last, the highest weight you ever been, when you got on that scale and it said 395, 
it's like the light bulb came on and said how big do you have to be how much do you have to wait what does the scale have to read before you realize that you are obese and you need to lose weight so that was my story not to mention the fact that I love to look good I love my high heel shoes I love clothes I love to dress um, but I have many many times told myself this is just it this is just me but that's not what I really felt in my heart and therefore I had to make a decision to do something about it so don't give up if I can do it oh my god you can do it if I can do it anybody because y'all I love 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 food I don't think that's gonna ever change but what did change I had to make up my mind that just as I brush my teeth every day just as I breathe every day just as I eat every day just as I talk to the Lord and pray every day I must incorporate exercise into my day pretty much every day and if I miss a couple of days you best believe I'm not gonna miss any more than three days of exercise so don't give up you might have already given up but get back on get back on the bus get back on the wagon get back on you know your journey and don't give up but you must make a decision to move your body you've got to do it you've got to do it. you've got to move your body and when you do you're gonna feel so much better okay I just wanted to encourage somebody you know maybe just one of you needed to hear that um, y'all I love y'all I appreciate your kindness your encouragement and you all have been a major factor in my weight loss because you all have inspired encouraged me and I know that you look to me for uh, motivation and encouragement and inspiration and knowing you look look to me makes me say let me get up out of here and get to LA Fitness because I don't want to let you guys down just like I don't want to let myself down alright love y'all y'all be blessed we can do this we can do this you guys I'm about 60 pounds down